TV. Today we're here at the RCBS factory and I've got Will here and yep. three very nice Matchmaster powder dispensers. Will, welcome to the show. Thank you. Glad to be here. So why don't you go ahead and uh, tell us about the unit. Uh, we had one, we covered it. Uh, maybe you can go a little further and sure. give us the brain behind the whole product. Absolutely. So the RCBS, the Matchmaster powder dispenser, it was designed to be the pinnacle powder dispenser for RCBS. And we've been known for the Charge Master 1500, the Charge Master Lite, uh, kind of one of the leaders in the powder dispensing, uh, powder dispensing realm of the reloading market. Um, so with the Matchmaster, we wanted to come out with the absolute best powder dispenser that we could um, for those match shooters, for the precision shooters, the guy that's looking to get every ounce of accuracy out of their loads. I mean, this, this thing will measure to four hundredths of a grain accuracy in match mode. Or it'll go to tenth the uh, the tenth of a grain in your standard mode, so it can be just as accurate as your charge master in standard mode. Or you go to that match mode, you're going to four hundredths of a grain, and you're doing it very very quickly. Right, and it's a very versatile scale. That's a wonderful wonderful thing about the unit is it's you've got that match mode, you've got that standard mode, and you've got the tunability yes. through the app, and that's also you're also able to tune it using the pad as well. So the app's Correct. not a required. Yeah, and kind of one of the ways we've been able to do that and get the additional speed and everything out of it, if you look at the unit, there's two dispense tubes. So you've got that big tube, which really spins really fast and drops a large volume of powder out really quickly. Then you have your smaller tube, which will trickle just that final amount to hit your your target weight. And we can, we'll show that in a little bit. But yeah, you're also able to go through the app, which is really simple to do. It's on the App Store and the Google Play Store. But you can go through and set all your parameters with the slide rule. I can show you, we'll show you that a little bit later on just kind of how that works. Or you can go in through the unit if you don't have an app and don't want to connect it to the unit through Bluetooth. You can go through that and you can change all the parameters. So it's really easy to tune that. And I mean, we'll show you kind of those, what you can accomplish once you tune that versus just one of the standard profiles in the unit. Um, like I said, it has Bluetooth, which is really cool. It's the first. RCBS product that we've come out with that has that Bluetooth connectivity. Um, some of the other cool features is we have the bottom pour, bottom train, bottom drain ability of it. So you just set the unit off the side of your bench just a little bit, and then you un, you open up the, the slot with the tube, and you can just pour that powder directly into into your bottle. Which makes sense to me because then you're using gravity to empty it rather than having it shoot out the side or something like that, which you see in a lot of older and other units. Right, and I mean with that side pour you're picking those units up anyway, you're readjusting everything to get that off. So you, with being able just to put it over the edge and let everything go, it's really convenient. There's also a, a drain function built into those tubes where you just hit the trickle function, it'll help clear out those tubes once you've removed most of the powder out of the unit. And the, one of the other cool things that we have on this that nobody else has is there's an open drain alarm built into it. So if the drain is still open on the unit and you're going to pour more powder in, as long as the unit's on, it's going to beep at you telling you that, hey, you got powder, you got your drain open, you're going to get powder all <laughs> over your bench. Right, and just about every hand loader out there who has something similar to this has done that at least once. Oh, absolutely, at least one time. I mean, I've done it a couple times. And you, I won't tell you how many times I've done it. It happens. It happens, but <laughs> it I mean, does. just having that audible, that audible drain just kind of helps reinforce, hey, dummy, you need to, you need to shut that drain before you pour more powder in. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's go through these, and I'll show you, let's drain, let's put this powder back in. So these three units we have here, like I said, this one has the custom tune. Uh, this one is in your standard mode, and that one's in match mode. It's actually got a couple of pearls in here on this. Let's get that powder off. Make sure we're zeroed. So we'll just go through in standard mode, and you can see kind of how quick this unit is. Let's do 42 and a half grains. I won't, I won't hit the power button again. So in standard mode, we're throwing to, to one tenth of a grain, and that's I mean the stop points on this this particular profile is pretty solid. So right, and it's pretty pretty speedy for what it is. Absolutely. So it's just trickling up that last kernel. Now, one question while it's dispensing I want to throw at you. I know in match mode it's very sensitive yes. to any vibration on the table. Is standard mode a little less sensitive, or would you, would you still want it on a very stable platform where you're not seeding bullets? And I, would, I, would, I mean, it's still, I mean, this one's in standard, so I mean, I can just kind of blow a little air across it. And if you watch the screen, 
I mean, it still picks up. It still picks up that air. So I mean, you still, if you're using one of these types of dispensers, you do want to have it on a very oh, on stable, a very stable platform. I mean, preferably off a different table than what your bench is. Right. Because any type of vibrations could cause a kernel to go through that unit. Perfect. Um, so let's go to. I'm gonna walk over here real quick and. So this one's actually connected to, to the Bluetooth. We've got our app, so you can see it. You can dispense with the app, or you can dispense with the unit itself. Let me dispense here with the app. So I'm in the app. Got a default dispense speed set up. Or you're going to throw this one in match mode. So there's a little, just a little uh, info on match mode that tells you about your higher accuracy, but it's going to take longer. I don't necessarily need to see it again. So let's do manual, and we'll do 42.50 grains. And we'll hit go. As you can see, you can see the, all the charge weights matching up with the screens. So the unit's talking back and forth with, with your iPad. Right, it has that constant communication back and forth. and yeah. You're able to go through and calibrate it using the app, and you have load log capability with the app. Absolutely, yeah, there's a, there's a ton of features in this app. You don't necessarily have to have a match master to use it. You can store all, you can use the load log without even having a match master. So any reloader can, can download the app and, and get that features. So I mean, it shows you where our load weight is, charge weight, go to complete. And let's just go back home here. So like if we did wanna adjust those powder settings, I could go into powder settings here. I could put in a custom, so let's add one. So I could go in and, and name it, search for your different powders. Um, so I want to start with the fast setting. That'll set all of your, let's see, let's match mode, got it. <coughs> so once I come through here, it'll set up all the default settings for the charge that we just threw. And then we can come in and just adjust some of these different stop points. So it's really easy and intuitive to go through there. Perfect. And now I'll step over here to this third unit. This is the one that we have the custom parameter in match mode. Uh, I think earlier we had it about 12, 12 and a half seconds, I believe. <coughs> You're holding your breath, waiting for that last little bit. Exactly. You don't want to. You don't want to get too close and <laughs> blow on that. That uh, that balance. There you go. So I mean that one was, as you can see, quite a bit quicker. Right, and that's in match mode. Yes. Which is accurate to four hundredths of a grain. Yep. Right. So really a great unit, and it'll definitely appeal to all those uh, PRS shooters, the guys who are really competing heavily. You know, th this translate. If you the more accurate your powder charge is, this translate in a lower extreme spread, lower standard deviation, all that good stuff. Absolutely. More consistency, and that's I mean, what it's all about. Right. If you're looking to get the absolute most accurate load possible, then you've got to use a unit like this to get there. Absolutely, and it's a uh, what's the balance on it? A strain. strain? It uses a strain gauge. Okay. Yep, strain gauge load cell, which, I mean, there's a couple different ways you can do it. Uh, I mean, our strain gauge load cell has really, really tight specifications to where, I mean, you have people that will... Top tier kind of stuff. Yes, sir. You'll have people that will take, I mean, you find the videos online of people that compare them to, to the different scales that are twice as much, and you're, right. get, you're getting the same, the same charge weights on this scale that you see on theirs. Outstanding. Well, thank you so much. Yep. We thank do appreciate it. Absolutely. Anytime. Glad to, glad to be able to tell you guys about it. Well, thank you for having us. Until next time, we'll catch you on the next video. Be sure to like this one, subscribe, and share it with your reloading friends.